No, I don't challenge in any way the great significance of the discovery of the double helical nature of DNA and the way it is arranged in, in cells and functions in cells, nor do I challenge in any way the one-way sequence um, coding, if one wants to use that word, from DNA to RNA to proteins, and no possibility of the sequence of amino acids in a protein somehow being back translated into um, uh, RNA or DNA. And indeed, it couldn't be, for very good technical reason, um, the coding between those DNA sequences and the protein amino acid sequences is redundant, and therefore it's actually, strictly speaking, impossible.